Those that uh, share it with me in labor and these deacons who are sharing for the body of Christ. Uh, indeed, I, I, I join with you today in, in what we know as life yeah. on this side. Amen. Yes, Amen. Amen. To these ushers, we thank God for, for you. We ask special blessings. Uh, there's a couple of points that I want to, to, to give that I've written down. I did not want to jump over this. Uh, first thing I want to talk about is, is prayer. Mm -hmm. Prayer is necessary right. for us on this side. Yeah. Yeah. God has brought prayer as a way of communicating with him mm -hmm. uh, directly. Directly. I don't have to go through other channels. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I can call on the Father and begin to talk with him yeah. about where I am and what I'm going through. Yes, sir. These scriptures that Paul has left for us to, to live by, it reminds us that we were created by God for God's purpose. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. How can you do what God asks you to do without talking to him first? Yes, sir. Prayer is necessary. Mm -hmm. Christians must pray. Yeah. Without prayer, then how? Can we move forward yes, in the faith? Mm -hmm. The Bible says that we don't know what to pray about. Yeah. In those times, the Holy Spirit gives us utterance. Yes. Yes, Still, I stress the importance of praying. Yes, yes, Prayer is not only necessary, <coughs> but it is expected. Mm -hmm. God expects for you to pray. All right, all right. He wants to hear your voice. Yes, he yes, wants sir. to know what's on your heart. Yes, he wants to hear your expression. Yes, sir. God wants you to pray. In Matthew chapter 6, verse 5, it says, Why, When you pray, uh -huh. don't pray yeah. as the others do. Yes, right. When you pray, mm -hmm. God is saying to us, He's expecting us to pray. Yes, sir. Not to be seen yeah. right, like right. the Pharisees and Sadducees. Yeah, yeah. Just want to be seen yes, praying. Yes, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. God want to hear you. Yeah. What you feel, what you experience. Yeah. So prayer is expected. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Colossians chapter 4, verse 2, it says, devote yourself to prayer. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yes, prayer has to be a priority. Yes, sir. Not only does God expect you to pray, he wants you to make it your duty yeah, yeah, yeah. to pray. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Living on this side, uh -huh. every one of us can testify yeah. that any time is a good time yes, to talk with the master. Yes, yeah. How much do I pray? Well, uh -huh. First Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 17, it says, pray without ceasing. That's right. That's right. That's you right. don't stop praying. Yes, sir. Not on this side. Yes, sir. Praise the Lord. Yes, sir. We want to pray continually. Mm -hmm. Exercise in prayer like an activity yes, is something that I do on the regular. Right. Continue prayer means continue expectation. Mm -hmm. If you pray to God all the time, you're going to want to hear from God all the time. Right. Can I get a witness? Yes, so we want to make sure that we pray continually. Mm -hmm. well, how much faith does it take for me to pray? Mm -hmm. Well, the Lord says, if you have faith the size of a mustard seed, yes, you can tell mountains to move. Yes, the little faith that you have is enough yes, to reach God. Yes, can I get a witness? Yes, Prayer is a learned behavior. Mm -hmm. It's not something that you do automatically. Yes, when a child is born into this world, they don't just start praying. Yes, they have to be taught. Yes, so God expects us yes, to teach this world how to pray. Yes, In fact, his disciples asked the question, yep. Lord, teach us how to pray. Yes, Jesus said, Our Father, yep. who art in heaven, how to be thy name, thy kingdom come, yep. thy will be done. Help me finish it. Yes, on earth, on earth yes, as it is in heaven, heaven. Yes, give us this day our daily, daily bread. bread. See, you know how to pray. Yep. See what I'm saying? Uh -huh. You were taught the Lord's prayer. Yes, and the world needs to know how to pray. It doesn't mean that, that many of us are, are stronger or weaker in prayer. Yeah. It means that our voices are being heard. Right. Amen. You know how Amen. I know? Mm -hmm. 
Because the Lord said his ear is inclined yeah. to the righteous. Yes. He's Amen. listening for yes. a prayer. Yes. Prayer is a challenge uh, of discipline. It's a chair of wantonness. It's a, it's a challenge of, 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 of readiness. When should I pray? Pray without ceasing. Yes. You know, when we look at the Bible, it said that Paul and Silas, they prayed. Yes. A lot of us emphasize just the point when they were in jail. Mm -hmm. I'm going to let you know, if you know how to pray, when your things are going well, yeah. Yeah. when hell come around, yeah. it won't be hard to do. Yeah. Amen. 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 You don't have to go to jail to start praying. Amen. Start praying now. That way, when you do go, you know what to say. Amen. <laughs> God is good. Yeah, okay. Amen. I want to make sure those points I wanted to put out there early uh, because you are a living sacrifice. Yes, he, here, here, is, here is where we, we understand that we're living in dangerous times. Yes, we live in a dangerous atmosphere. Yeah. Yeah. If, if this world was easy to live in, Jesus had not come to die. Yes, you, you, your body is going to be tested. Yes, sir. Your mind is going to be tested. Yes, sir. Your family is going to be tested. Yeah. We are a living sacrifice. Yeah. Yeah. But God wants us to be a sacrifice that brings honor unto him. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Lord said, be holy for he's holy. Yeah. So that means in the, the way that I live, I want to learn how to be a holy sacrifice. Yes. Can I get a witness? Yes. Can, can, you, can you live your days and, and nights without letting sin dominate? Yes. Can I get a witness? Yes, Many of us think in our, in, our, in our mind that we have the power to, to correct ourselves. Uh -huh. Wrong answer. All that sin and come short of the glory of God. I don't care how perfect your line is today. It's no more perfect than God's. Can I get a witness? And if he said that our righteousness is filthy rags before him, yeah. your best day you still yeah. coming up short. Yeah. All right. yeah. Look at your neighbor and say, I need the Lord. I need, I need the Lord. Lord. The truth is we need God. And he is the holiness that is in our lives. Yes. It's not because you are perfect. It's because his righteousness yes. is perfect. Yes. And when God is doing a perfect work inside of you, Satan can't stop it. Yes. Can I get a witness? Yes. God is what makes me acceptable unto him. All right. If what, everything that I do it comes up short, then I will never be acceptable. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. But because Jesus died on the cross yeah. and covered me yes, and my sins are erased, yes, he has made me acceptable in the sight of God. Yeah. Yeah. You know, when God looks at you, those who have accepted Jesus Christ in your life, he sees Jesus. Yeah, yeah. Can I get a witness? Yeah, yeah. That's what he's looking for. Yeah, he's trying to see if Jesus is inside of you. Yeah. Have you accepted him to be the Lord of your life? Amen. Yeah. And if you've accepted him to be the Lord of your life, then he's in position. When God looked down, he see that Jesus is in your life. Amen. And that makes you acceptable. Can I get a witness? Yeah, yeah. Which is your reasonable service? Uh, I'm going to stop right here just for a minute just to have a little church. Because folk don't want you to see Christ in them. But the only thing that is acceptable... The only way you can serve, the only way you can do what God asks you to do, you got to have Christ in you. Amen. Because Jesus said that I am the vine and you are the branches. He says it. He breaks it down. He said, if you and I are one, yeah. amen, you can do all things. But if I'm not in you, you can do nothing. Can I get a witness? The only reason why I'm able to serve, the only reason why I'm able to go through my ups and downs and still have joy is because Jesus is in my life. Yes, God is speaking to us as he, in verse 2, he said, and be not conformed to this world, meaning that this world can contaminate you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It can mess you up. Yeah. How many of us been messed up? Amen. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Praise the Lord. Yeah, everybody should raise your hand. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. You ain't messed up. You don't need Jesus. Can I go with it? All of us have experienced some things on this side that, that, that we needed Christ to save us from. Yeah, Can I yeah. get a witness? Let the redeemed of the Lord say so. So when the Bible said, be not conformed to this world, you cannot think that you are above this world. Amen. This world can mess you up. Come on. Amen. Yes, sir. Praise the Lord. This world will encourage you to have the big head. Yeah. yeah. Make yeah. you feel like you're really making all the right decisions. Yeah. By yourself. Right. When it's the Lord that gives. Yeah. And the Lord, Lord that, that takes take away. Yeah. Make you feel as if you created something, you made something. Yeah. But it was God. 
who said, let there be light. It was God who opened up the doors and the windows of heaven and toured you out the blessing that you consider yours today. Can I get a witness today?